But if you close your eyes Hey guys, Frostvox here and welcome back to my Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzzle. Alright, first things first, uh, if you saw my last video, uh, you'll know that my dad was in hospital. But good news, he's doing a lot better. He's had an operation, he had a um, burr hole operation, which is a couple of holes in the skull. But no, it all went well and he's recovering now so it's all good so he's doing a lot better which is really good news and yes that's all I was going to mention so that's all good news and I have started playing the Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon as well I'm not very far yet but it is a very good game I'm thoroughly enjoying the new Pokemon games Anyway, now that I've said that, we're going to jump back into Pokemon Platinum. Now, let's see what happened in the last episode. Um, we did Eternia Forest, that's right, we got through that. And this is my team at the moment. We, we did search this town. Uh, did we have a fight? I think we fought our rival up here. And that's about as far as we got. And I've done a little bit of training in between, not a lot. But we will go over my Pokemon. So Slowbro's on 20. Has Confusion, Aquatail, Crab Hammer, and Hydro Pump. He did learn Aquatail in the training. Um, what did he have before? He had Dive, that was it. So we got rid of Dive, even though I might not need that later, I'm not sure. But we get it as a HM anyway. Anyway, uh, Bayleaf's on 21, still with Bullet Seed, Needle Arm, Leaf Blade and Energy Ball. Omanyte's on 18 with Poison Tail, Dark Pulse, Brian, and he learned Octazooka. And Kabutops is on 15, still with Head Smash, Stone Edge, Sandstorm and Akarine. And he has the experience to share, and so does Omanyte, because we picked up a second one. So that was great, and that's basically where we're up to. Now, I think what we need to do in this episode is go through to here. Which is the Team Galactic building. But we will need Cut, so let's see who can learn Cut. Okay, well we all can learn cut. I'm going to give it to Kabutops. I know it's not a great move, but we will need cut. I could give it to the HM Pokemon I caught, which who was it? Linoon, that's right, but we'll probably give it to Kabutops anyway. Let's have a look. He's got Head Smash, Stone Edge, Sandstorm, and Aqua Ring. What's Cut? Cut is 50 and 95, so it's not terribly strong. But Head Smash is good. Oh, actually, that's not very good because that hits with recoil damage. The user also takes terrible damage. Stone Edge has a high critical hit ratio. As good as Head Smash probably is, I'm not going to use it if it does terrible damage to us. Aqua Ring is alright for healing, but it's not great or anything, but Sandstorm is good because it does damage a little bit each turn. Stone Edge is probably handy. I'm going to get rid of Head Smash because I don't think I'm going to use that if I'm going to take a lot of damage. So we'll have Cut instead of Head Smash. 
it might be good on a normal playthrough, but this is a Nuzlocke and that's pretty bad. So we'll do that, I think. And while we're going, what else do we have? We have Rock Smash, which is only 40. Wake Up Slap, Sucker Punch, Thundershot, Icy Wind, and Assist. Um, I think we'll leave them for the moment. Alright, now that that's done, I'm pretty sure we've searched most of the town, because it's been, well, it's been a good two weeks. Seeing my father's been in the hospital and everything. So we'll just have a quick look through the town again, but I think I've done it. And if you've started playing uh, the new Pokemon games, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, let me know, because they're very good. I'm only on the second island at the moment. I am enjoying them. It's a shame I can't put them on YouTube, but I'll have to wait till I get a catcher card before I can do that. Hope I'm hoping that'll be next year. I'm trying to save me money up for that. So we'll see how we go. This guy's going on about the legendaries by the look. Palkia and Dialga. Finished? Okay, good. Oh, we actually haven't been over here. This is Route to 11. We can catch a Pokemon there, but I'm going to wait. I'd like to probably do that once I've done the gym. But let's... The gym is down here. Actually, let me just check the gym before we go in there. Ah, she's at the front. Oh, and there's actually an item I just saw. If we go over here and grab that. Silver powder. Okay. I don't think anything happens. We will talk to her and she'll just go in the gym. But we won't do the gym yet. Because I think I'm going to do the building. And we'll take on Team Galactic. So let's go in here. Oh wait, we can't use cut anyway, can we? Oh bugger. Oh, I'll scratch that. It looks like we're doing the gym first because we probably need the badge to use cut outside of battle. Alright, let's talk to her, Gardenia. Awesome. All right. Well, looks like we're doing the gym today, so let's jump straight into it. And we'll try and get our... It's only our second badge, so... Uh, it won't be grass types. It is randomized, but... Are you going to give us anything? No, not even a fresh water. Alright, looks like we got. I think we got to battle most of the trainers in here to turn the middle to actually get to the gym leader. So let's start with her. She has a Mr. Mime. It's not a bad matchup. Let's go Crab Hammer. Okay, that was more than half, so one more time. It's not going to do anything. Alright, there goes Mr. Mime. And Kabutops went to level 16. Good. Wants to learn... Oh, Kabutops wants to learn dive. Okay. That's actually probably better for Kabutops, because he is physical. I 
I reckon Sandstorm is a little bit better than Aqua Ring because we can still use items for healing. So let's get rid of Aqua, Win Aqua Ring for Dive. That'll be good, I think. Excellent. And here comes an Octillery. Yeah, we'll switch, we'll go to Bayleaf and make it nice and easy. Easy victory. Still does that skipping, I never was able to fix that. We'll have to live with that. Okay, that did over half, so one more time. Confusion. It's fine. And oh, he lived on one. He flinched even better. Let's go bullet seed just to finish him off. Excellent, there goes one trainer. Now that should move. It's going to be... Where's it going? Oh, there we go, quarter past six. Okay. Run over this, take on this trainer. Free Pokemon. A Sentry. I was about to say, is that shiny, but I don't think it is. Okay, for him, let's go Confusion. Flinched. There we go. One hit. Excellent. A cat turn. A cat turn. I think I'm better off staying in. And we'll go Confusion. Oh, he's got Pursuit. Damn, I was thinking Dark Tide moves would be bad. It doesn't affect him. Okay. Alright, I think with that we will have to switch. Now, Grass types really destroy Omanyte and Kabutops. I think we're going to have to go to Bayleaf. Just adjusting my mic, hang on. Okay, um... He, he must have attacked first. Gee, yeah, just as well we switched. Just as well we switched. Um... Okay, let's see. Let's just go Needle Arm and see what that does. I know it won't be very effective, but he flinched, excellent. If we can get him to flinch each time, that'll be great. Energy Roar, that's not going to do much to us either. Special Defense went down, okay, let's go Leaf Blade. Right, that one more of those should take him out. Although, I'm going to have to heal. There goes Cacturn anyway. Oh, 
Omanite went to 19. Fantastic. Wants to learn Lucky Chant. I think his moves are okay, actually. Poison Tail, Dark Pulse, Brine, and Octazooka. I don't think he needs Lucky Chant. Yeah, okay. Preventing critical hits. Yeah, I don't think we need that. Uh, this one. Yep. Cool. Okay, Slow King is next. I think we will stay in, but I'm going to have to heal. Check on my items. Let's use a super potion. It's level 16 slow king. Water pulse. Okay, that won't do much. Probably trying to get the confusion. Alright, we'll go straight to a leaf blade. Super effective. One hit. Fantastic. Excellent. Now I might just go to Pokemon Center and I might even grab another Super Potion. Okay, the middle will change first. Quarter past nine, and those water things should go down. Excellent. And we can jump past them, jump out. And it marks here, we'll go here. I will grab a super potion. Just to replace the one I just used. I'm hoping I don't need many more. I'd probably like some fresh waters or something because they're cheaper. Anyway, we'll heal. Um, Omanite or Kabutops if I have to, otherwise I want to really try and get them over level 20 before we use them. Alright, that's done, let's go back into the gym. And we'll take on the next trainer, which we have to go this way. keeps falling down. I might have to adjust that after the video. It slowly goes down. Anyway, we've got an Iggly buff. A confusion should do the trick. 19. Nearly. Nearly. Alright, let's do one more of those. And there goes the Iggly buff. Well, that was easy. That was the only one she had. Well, considering she didn't even hit us, we'll go straight to the gym leader. Okay, quarter to twelve. And down goes the water. All 
Alright, here we go, here is Gardenia. Battle for our second badge. Okay, three Pokemon. Starting with Hitmonchan. Okay. Fighting time. Let's go Aquatail. Rolling Kick. Not very effective. Great. I flinched though. Okay. Okay, half damage. One more time. Not very effective. Great, didn't flinch. Aquatail. Oh, so close. Confusion. There's a super potion. Super effective confusion. Let's do that again. Rolling kick, that's fine. And... Got him. Great. And that takes Slowbro to 21. Fantastic. A Weedle. Oh, that's easy. No, I won't switch. While we have an easy opponent, I'll just use a potion. Just get 20 points back. Bug bite. Oh, the moves are randomized, of course. I'm thinking it would have tackle and string shot. Or poison sting. Let's go confusion. It does have Bug Bite, which is super effective, surprisingly. But so is Confusion, and we got him. Kabutops went to 17, fantastic. And Craniados is next. Here's a rock type. Okay, you know what? I might just switch to Kabutops. Oh, he's a twenty two. It's, pro oh, it's probably a bad decision, but let's try his dive and see how much damage it does. Super effective. Oh, fantastic. We got him in one hit. Great. Nice boost for Kabutops. Excellent. That wasn't too hard at all. Excellent. Great. And we received the forest badge. Excellent. Badge number two. And now we can use cut outside of battle. Excellent. Okay, traded Pokemon will be obey you up to level 30. Fantastic. And we get TM86. Bounce. Alright, let's see if that's true. Doesn't sound like what you usually give out bounce, so let's see if it is bounce. Twelve thirty. 
Anyway, let's check out that TM. Past it. It is bounce. Okay. That is a flying type move. 85 and 85. Okay, that's not too bad. But no one can learn it. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, well that's fantastic. Let's get out of here. And we'll go to the Pokemon Center. Now that we can use Cut, we can go into the Team Galactic building. But we're actually at 25 minutes, so I might even leave the episode there. And yes, it is good news about my father. He's just recovering in hospital still at the moment, but... Yeah, he seems to be a lot better than what he was, which is great. And if you like, you can tell me where you are on Pokemon Ultra Sun or Ultra Moon. That'd be nice to hear about. I'm still on the second island. I'm just about to do the third trial, I believe. That's where I left it. And we are at 26 minutes, so you know what guys, I'm going to leave this episode right here and next time we'll do the Team Galactic building. Now that we can use Cut, Kabutops has that, excellent. I won't walk in there though, I think something happens. And there is an item to the side there, which we will get in the next episode. Alright guys, thanks for watching, uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe and everything. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Alright guys, see you later. Skip that trainer. I might skip this guy if I can. Ooh, an Empoleon. Oh, he would have been nice. Oh, I kind of wish I caught him now. Ooh, I don't know if I can run. Let's just switch. We'll go to Bayleaf.